All right, first off, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashim Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashim Rakaq Kadash, Dwari Yahweh Ba'ashim Yahweh Shai, for allowing me to do another video through the Spirit. Dwari Yahweh Ba'ashim Yahweh Shai, for giving us this truth as worms. Double honor to our apostles and elders at Great Millstone, and salutation and blessings to the hopeful elect. And this is going to be a video off this scripture right here, and these are the times that we're entering into, man. A second Kings, I'm going to just get right into it, to be honest. This is Second Kings 6 and verse 25. And there was a great famine in Samaria. And a famine is coming, man. A, a famine, not only of bread, but a famine of this truth. Both those famines are coming. Famine of food and a famine of the word of Yahweh Hashem Shai. And behold, they besought, they besieged it until an ass head was sold for fourscore pieces of silver and, that, and that's a lot of money for an asset, or is it four score 80 pieces? Of, that's 80 pieces of silver. And the, in the, in the fourth part of the, of the, what's that, cab of doves dung for five pieces of silver. So they was eating shit, man. They was eating uh, donkey heads and bird shit, man. Hey, hey. And all this toilet paper that you people are, are stocking up and buying, you're gonna eat that shit, man. You're gonna make you're gonna make uh what's the pasta tar say? You're gonna make uh 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 what's that he said uh toilet paper soup, man. <laughs> but hey, check this out right here. This is uh verse twenty six. And the king of Israel was passing upon passing by upon upon the wall, and they cried a woman unto him, saying, Help my lord, O king. And this is what we're gonna say to you people, man. Hey, this is this is a, 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 a hard hardcore saying, man. He said, and he said, if the Lord Yahweh do, do not help thee, when shall I help thee out of out of barn barn flour or out of the wine press? So he basically said, Look, if the Lord not helping you, what can I do? And that's how those are the times. That we're about to enter into, man. And it, it goes on about uh, how she they basically committed uh, cannibalism and killed uh, killed her son and uh, uh, ate her. They, they, they ate her son. But, hey, those are the times that we're entering into, man. Hey, like it says, the beginning of sorrows, man. The beginnings of great death, man. The beginnings of mourning. These are the days and times which Jehovah Shimei Shai has prophesied from the beginning to happen. This is this is what what we've been doing, man. Now kingdom come. This is going to bring forth the kingdom of Yahweh by Shemiah Shai. Great sorrow, man. Great sorrow, great death. But a Yahweh by Shemiah Shai is going to protect us, man. And that's that's one thing you have to keep in mind. The Lord's going to protect us, man. Yahweh by Shemiah Shai is going to protect us as long as we believe in Him and keep His name upon our upon our tongues. But uh. I was gonna to jump to another scripture from from there. Be, uh just on the famine. Get another scripture of famine. It's Isaiah uh nine and verse nineteen. Through the wrath of the Lord Yahweh by Shemiah Shai of hosts, the land is darkened, and the people shall shall be as fuel of the fire, no man shall shall spare his brother. And he shall stretch out the right hand, and and be hungry. And he shall eat up, eat on the left, and they shall not be satisfied. They shall eat every one the flesh of his own hand. Manasseh, Ephraim, and Ephraim, Manasseh, they together against Judah. For all this, his anger is not turned away. But his hand is stretched out still. So this is a hey, the Lord Yahweh by Shemiah Shai. His hand is stretched out still, man. His anger is coming upon the earth, and this is what the Lord Yahweh Yahweh by Shemiah Shai was talking about, man. Second Ezra nine, Second Ezra nine, and verse verse one. He answered me then and said, Measure thou the time diligently in itself, and when thou seest part of the signs pass which I have told thee before, then shalt thou understand. That is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to world to visit the world which he made. Therefore, when thou seest, when thou shalt. Therefore, 
when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world, then shalt thou well understand that the Most High spake of these things that, that were from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. So these things were spoken about even from the beginning, man. These things that have been prophesied and told for thousands of years, man. Shit, the prophets was around in the, in the garden with Adam and Eve. So, hey, these things have been told told and spoken about since the beginning of time, man. These things are were always meant to happen, and they're are they're happening, man. Hey, it's a hey, like the I'm watching the brothers, the uh, uh, current uh, current situation, the the br brother uh, Kapatiza and Jeremiah from the GMS Chicago. Hey, this is serious, man. Hey, downtown, our downtown is desolate, man. Hey, if their downtown is desolate, ours is definitely desolate. I went downtown yesterday, man. It was empty, man. Quiet, quiet, man. I've never seen no shit like that in my life, man. Silent. You can, you can hear a pin drop. All you had was a few cars on the road, and that's it, man. This shit, bro, fucking gyms closed, the NBA's closed. The in the NHL is closed. Uh, 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 fucking San Francisco is, sh is on lockdown, man. They closed the borders. This ain't happening for no reason. This is Yahweh, man. This is Yahweh by Shimei Shai approaching this earth. This, this ain't going on for no reason, man. These are the things which Yahweh by Shimei Shai has, has prophesied about to happen in these days and times, man. Second Ezra is 15 and, and, and 16. Second Ezra is a book. A, the Second Ezra is 15, the book. Second Ezra is uh, 16, the book. The chapter, I'm sorry. So lucky. These things are happening, man. But what? Yahweh Shemiah Shai is going to protect us. Uh, hey, this is, uh, I'm thinking about the brother Nawak. For the one of the younger brothers, but for this scripture, it's Sirach four and twenty eight. Strive for the truth unto death, and the Lord shall fight for thee, man. If we be those men, if we be those prophets, man, which we pray and hope we are, hey, if we strive for this unto death, man, the Lord's gonna fight for us, man. He's gonna protect us. He's gonna be with us, man. It's gonna get real bad, man. It's gonna get real bad, real harsh. Things that we haven't seen, man. Things that we haven't seen on this planet ever before. The scriptures say that it's going to be as something never before, man. Yeah, we've read about 70 AD. We've read about the famines in the scriptures. We've read about the different things that happened. But what in every incident, in all these incidents of great turmoil, great death in the scriptures and history, who was always protected, man? When you look at the famine during during uh, Second Kings, Elijah, uh, uh, I believe it was Elisha or Elijah. It was Elisha. It had to be Elisha. He, uh, he, he was, he was straight during the famine, man. He was by a brook. The Lord was feeding him. Oh, uh, 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 there's many other accounts. Can't, can't think of them all right now, but hey. Hey, the Lord's with us, man. He's he showed us time and time again, man. He's with us. But hey, this is just something real quick. Hey, we hey soon, hey, we not gonna be on them highways and byways just to throw that out there, man. For all you scoffers out there. We enter in serious times. So with that, I want to give all praises to our power, Yahweh, by Shimi Al Shai, by Shimmer Kakwadash. The Wadi Yao by Shimi Al Shai for allowing me to do another video through the spirit. The Wadi Yao by Shimi Al Shai for giving us his truth as worms. Double honors to our apostles and others at Great Millstone and salutations and blessings to the hopeful elect. Hey, like Yahweh Shai said, man, lift up your head. Your heads, man. Our salvation draws nigh, brothers. Our salvation draws nigh. Yeah, it's going to get bad. Yeah, it's going to get real ugly. But our salvation draws nigh. With that, Shalom.